day five. What up, players? It's Warbot Stay Up in this mug. Welcome to my Spooky Toberfest Day Five video. It is Monday, October fifth, and we are showing off the work for our Day Five in the month-long Spooky Tober Challenge. Here we've got our Grombrado Van Helsing. He's all built up. All I had to do was glue the hat on, glue the hands on and uh, he is ready to go. There was a lot of cleaning I had to do to clip him out of the frame and clean him up. He's got a lot of flash and uh, venting down here at the bottom. And there was a really terrible mold line going down the top of the center of his hat, down the back and down the front brim. In fact, when I was shaving the mold line off the back of his hat, the, the material is so brittle, you can see that it kind of took a chunk out of the back brim of his hat there, which is too bad. I might try to use some modeling putty to even that out, but it's it's okay for now. You can see that there's the little dwarf rune on the, the end of the stake there, as well as the little um, seal on the front of his Puritan hat. And the expression is really well done. I, I think this model looks really, really nice except for the extra flash and mold lines and all that miscasting stuff. So he's all built up, so the next step is to prime him in black and get started painting him up. And I'm gonna pretty much do the color, follow the color scheme of the Games Workshop Heavy Metal team. Uh, I think I'm actually going to start though with the decorative base. Paint that up in a nice gray er uh, stonework, like a old crypt or tomb. I was thinking of either going with a light gray, like a whitish light marble, or going with dark and dank, and uh, instead of making it look like a church, making it look more like a crypt. So I still haven't decided yet. I know that I do want to have the table of our Goblin Dracula be a nice rich deep brown red, <clears throat> or reddish brown mahogany, and make the coffin that black marbled with green. And uh, that, that way we can have those nice dark colors contrasting with Goblin Dracula, who will be a little bit brighter and uh, have a little bit lighter color for the skin, as well as a nice light purple for his, his Dracula tuxedo. It's going to look really great. I hope you guys stay tuned and uh, continue to follow along my Spooky Tober project. The question of the week for week two from October 4th through the, I believe it is uh, 11th, is uh, what is a favorite childhood memory of yours from Halloween? And don't just stop with one if you're doing more than one update each week. Like I'm trying to do a video a day, then uh, give us multiples. What are some favorite memories of yours from Halloween growing up as a child and now as an adult? One of my favorite Halloween memories is uh, the first Halloween costume I ever had when I was a very young war boss, when I was just a, a little boss, was that my mom had made an Indian costume for me out of a supermarket paper bag, like a big grocery bag. She just cut holes for my arms and my, a hole for my head to stick through. And me and my sister had to dress up in these giant grocery bags and we decorated it with like construction paper and we made uh, belts and, and feathers and we made a headband and we were we were little engines for Halloween. It was quite fun. Hey, if I can find that picture, if, if I can, if my mom can find that picture, she's probably got it somewhere in her old photo albums. I might make a make a slide of it and show you what what baby Warboss Indian Tay looked like way back in the day. Anyways, I'd love to hear your your memories from Halloween's past. Please uh, feel free to post up a video in the Warboss Tay's 2015 Painting Community Google Group. It's a long name. Uh, don't worry about it. Just look at the description below. I'll put a link. And also you can check out my commission studio at warbosstastudios.com, all one word, warbosstastudios.com, or you can email me at warbosstastudios at gmail.com if you'd like to commission me for a project. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great day and we'll see you tomorrow for the next daily update. Do 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 do